thanks for choosing to watch this video. You made the right choice. I recently participated in Archfight, a yearly trading event. This is the second video in a three-part speed paint series for all of the attacks I did. I hope you enjoyed. This attack is for a user who goes by Fatal Bagel. They make some awesome stuff. I'll put links to all of my victims in the description, so please make sure to check them out. This character that I'm drawing is named March, nicknamed Muppin. He is a personification of a stray cat, and I think the design fits well. The beat up sweater and cargo pants are definitely what you'd see on a scrappy sort of character who lives on the streets, I think. Um, I tried to lean into a more smug type of personality with the pose and facial expression. I, I think it turned out really well. This was one of my favorite ones. So this attack is for a user who goes by Kifwen. He makes YouTube videos usually 
digital audio related things as well as short animations, pretty cool stuff. He also has very extensive lore and world building around his characters, at least from what I could tell. This character is named Lumsis, I think that's how it's pronounced, and she is part of a superhero team called Star Team. She has fire related powers and I'm not gonna lie, when I was looking through all of uh, Kifuin's characters, I saw another one that had ice based powers, and when I chose to draw Lumsis, I confused her with that other character. And so, I, I went into this drawing with ice in mind. I, I still think it turned out well, but if I could, I I'd probably go back and change some things like uh, the background color and how I wrote the name, I think. Hey, if you're enjoying the video so far and want to see more stuff like this, be sure to subscribe. I'd really appreciate any support. Thanks. So the last attack for this video is for a user who goes by Candied Sodas. I actually know her personally, but we don't talk at all. I'll refrain from giving more details so she doesn't kill me in case she ever sees this. Um, anyway, her style gives off more cutesy vibes. You can see from all of her character designs. I chose to draw Sorbet, one of her mascots. It was fun to do, I, I mostly struggled with the hair because I had to figure out how to place all the accessories. I also for some reason had some trouble with the leg warmers. I'm not sure why, though I think I got it right in the end. Honestly, most of my troubles came from the fact that the watermark caused a bit of eye strain when I tried to make out the details behind it, so it was kinda difficult. I also didn't account for the fact that the pose I chose uh, would have her covering the bag on her waist. I'm still happy with how it turned out, but I think I would have chosen a different pose if I had uh, you know, realized that.
so it was at this point that things began to go horribly wrong. The recording doesn't show it, but Paint.net started lagging and then crashed. This program frequently drops frames, which I take as a reminder of what I'll lose if I don't save my work. Uh, thankfully, I only had to redo the shading, and I started saving much more frequently after this. 